What do you think of that, man? No, 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 it's dope. I think I have something for it, too. Alright. Yeah, this is gonna work. It's <laughs> it's usually it's sunglasses awkward. and pizza because Mike always wants us to eat hamburgers you and pizza. You make us eat that every shit. Every time. Man. And then he blames it on me. Every time I come over, hey man, yeah. you pick some burgers up on the way. Oh, uh, that's right. That's the magic moment when it happens, right? Yeah, yeah. Nice. Senses unite us. For the filmmaker, art is an expression of what we see playing out before us and on the screens within our minds. For the musician, the music pours as inevitably as their ears will hear, and that what they hear will in part make them what they are. The painter, the sculptor, their hands, the storyteller's words. Art unites us, makes us who we are, just as our senses do. Because art is the expression of our ability to sense. We are what we do. Art is us. Alive. It comes and goes and waves over us. We share in it, keep it to ourselves. The inspiration to create, the desire to collect, to dance with cultured humanity. Does art unify us? Most, most definitely. How does it unify us? Who knows? But we do know that it does. We do know it always has. Walks of people from all around the world have all discovered art in one way or another. Whether it's music, whether it's hieroglyphs, whatever it is, they've all done it. No way there would be a world without art. It's no. impossible because no matter what, people have to express themselves in one way or another. Art is, is mandatory for, for a community to function. People are just appreciators of that art and that music. Maybe they don't know why exactly, but something they hear or something they see is, is, is connecting the dots for them somehow. It, it binds and unifies us whether we like it or not. Good or bad, positive reaction, bad reaction, it's still gonna unify. If a group of people are unified in hating a piece of art, that's unification. I don't think hate is necessarily a bad thing. I think it's quality control in a certain way. But at the same time, if it brings people together in a negative way, it's bringing people together. I went to school for graphic design and I never really wanted to do that. I always just wanted to draw. Everyone sees it differently, which is one of the best things about art. I think that the important factor is that people can feel welcome. A large part of what's made it work and is having a welcoming environment that people can feel creative in and to never cut that off. This is the nature of any sort of like studio or collective or anything is, you know, people come in, people come out. Municipalities, communities, artists, groups, or funding sources are willing to take risks. That's it. When you take risks, unexpected things happen. And that's what makes art, art. You cannot plan anything great. Absolutely not. I mean, anybody can put a hundred thousand dollar dress on a runway. It has absolutely nothing to do with what a kid on London is gonna, you know, wear on his feet. Guaranteed a couple years later it'll be on that runway. Stuff comes from grassroots, it comes from foundation, it comes from experimentation. <laughs>